Model T was like a revolutionary car, but it was also a revolutionary manufacturing process, right? Um, and they're saying that this universal EV platform will use something called, instead of an assembly line, an assembly tree. Uh, so tell us, like, what makes that different or better than the assembly line that Ford pioneered? So traditionally, cars have been manufactured on a single assembly line where parts are brought to the car and the vehicle continues sort of to move along the same path uh, until it's finished. Mm -hmm. So Ford's it kind of like so it kind of like snakes kind of like zig snakes around this plant adding parts until you get to a complete car. You start with like a body and then, you know, all these different parts go onto the body as it moves down this moving assembly line. You're right. It it just moves along the assembly line and then workers sort of bolt on parts and work on the car. Then the new the new line will break up the vehicle into three different sub assembly lines and those will work in parallel shrinking the overall time from start to finish and require fewer workstations. So the tree will so the assembly tree will start with three separate lines. Each will make the front, the rear and the central sub assemblies and the tree will then merge towards the end where all three parts come together.